What is up YouTube and in this video I'll be showing you guys how to use your USB drive to format your computer. So the first thing you want to do is you need a 4GB USB drive if you want to format a computer because the operating system tends to be around that size. So once you have your flash drive, plug it into your computer, which I already have done, and then open up command prompt. You can do that by clicking on the start button and typing in CMD if you're using Windows 7 or Windows Vista. If you're using Windows 8 or Windows XP, press the Windows key and R, which opens up the run program, and you can type in CMD there, and it does the exact same thing. So once you have command prompt open, uh, type in disk part, which opens up another program, which is another black screen, and you know you're in the right part um, where when it says disk part. So once you've done that, type in list disk, which shows you. Uh, all the disks that are connected to your computer so you can tell that disk 1 here is the flash drive because it's 4 gigabytes which is 3.9 megabytes it shows so that's 4 gigabytes that's my flash drive that is attached now once you have that type in select disk 1 or whichever disk it is that shows up on your computer most likely it's going to be disk 1 so once you have uh, once you do that it says disk 1 is now selected now once after that you want to click on clean or type in clean um, this at this point it wipes every file on your flash drive so make sure you save the things on your flash drive on to a different computer because I've lost a lot of things that way uh, okay so once you do that type in create partition This part succeeded in creating a specific partition. Now, type in select partition. Partition 1 is now selected. Uh, type in active. And it says the current partition is marked as active. And now type in format fs equals ntfs. That's the type of file system and it's going to be formatting it for you. Now this might take anywhere from a couple of minutes to a couple of hours based on how big your flash drive is. I did uh, the same thing with my hard drive and that took three hours because it's, uh, it's a terabyte. So I'm going to be back once this uh, formatting is completed. Okay, so it just completed successfully. This autoplay option might pop up on uh, on your computer. So I'm just going to close that. So once your formatting is 100% complete, just type in assign, which turns, uh, make sure I type first, which turns the uh, flash drive into a local drive. So once I do that, successfully assign that. Close that again, um, which gives it a letter and a mount point. At this point, this makes it bootable. So if you turn your computer and off, on and off, and yeah, I'm just gonna exit here. Once you um, turn your computer off and then back on again, then you're gonna be able to boot from the flash drive instead of the computer's hard drive. So what I'm going to do now is go to the computer. So I've mounted the ISO file of the Windows 7 operating system. If you have a CD for it, that's absolutely fine. Just pu put it into your computer. Um, it should look, some look something like this. Um, I'm just going to open it up. What you want to do is copy everything that's in there. So I'm just control click, control C, sorry, and then go back then go into removable disk H which is my flash drive and then just paste everything into there and once that's complete you can you can turn your computer off turn it back on and then select to boot from the flash drive I'm going to show you a video where I recently uh, formatted this laptop 
so I'm going to show you the video from there just to show you what it looks like and yeah I'll be right back once you turn your computer off and back on again it should prompt you to uh, press F9 or something like that once you do that this screen should show up and in that screen you can see that uh, F9 it says boot device options and then you press F9 and once you do that this screen should show up or something similar to that where it gives you a list of options for the device you want to boot from um, use a uh, USB hard drive is what I'm using you once you use that um, it should start loading your Windows file and your you should be on your way to format your computer or upgrade it or whatever it is you want to do also if you're thinking of upgrading to Windows 8 uh, I'd suggest it's a bad idea unless you have a computer that has a touch screen on it for a screen because I did upgrade my current laptop to Windows 8 and regretted it so here I am um, downgrading it again to Windows 7 so thanks for watching uh, I hope this helped and please leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed it cheers